And who is all too familiar with the Astros' playoff history is former Astros great Lance Berkman, a member of the Killer Bees who made a World Series run in 2005. Berkman also played for the New York Yankees, so you can see that he knows both teams very well. Our Sophia Beausoleil spoke with him today. She's joining us live with what Berkman had to say. Sophia? Well, you know what? Nowadays, you'll find him here at Second Baptist High School because this is where he coaches. But you know what? He knows a little something about Major League Baseball and he knows a thing or two about playing in a series. After school at Second Baptist High, you'll find Coach Berkman prepping the future of baseball. It's a good group of kids here, and I just love the fact that baseball is appealing to younger fans. And for this coach, he knows the importance of a crowd rooting you on. Remember Bagwell, Biggio? Well, Lance Berkman was also one of the killer bees for the Astros years ago, and he is proud of his former team and what they've accomplished so far. Well, I mean, you can't complain about the start they've gotten off to. Um, I think it was... It was especially important for them to win at home because they played so well there during the course of the regular season. I think that the Yankees are very comfortable at their home ballpark, so it's going to be a little different series uh, going up there than it was here. As the Astros head into Game 3 of the ALCS against the Yankees, Berkman, who is also known as the Big Puma, has a pretty unique perspective. You know, my heart's here in Houston. I played 12 years of my career, and I played three months with New York, although I have a tremendous respect for the Yankee organization. Organization. I think they're first class all the way, um, but you know, I'm, I definitely am, am an Astros guy. And he believes they'll go all the way. Berkman knows a thing about winning a World Series championship. He did in 2011 when he played with the St. Louis Cardinals. His advice? To always focus. And I always tell my guys, you know, it's one pitch at a time. It's literally, we're going to focus on this pitch, and as soon as it's over with, you move on to the next pitch. And in that way, you know, you, you keep it from getting too big, you keep the moment from getting too big, and you just, you know, you're there to do a job, and you, and you try to focus on doing that. And as you can imagine, he will be definitely watching tonight like many of you at home. He was there at the game on Friday, and he was there with some of his former cool colleagues. Bill and Dominique, y'all are awesome too, but it'd be pretty cool to be colleagues with some of the former Astros. Reporting live from Second <laughs> Baptist High School, Sophia Bosley, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Who, us? Top liver. <laughs>